<laughs> Hello Derek. Where are we Derek? <laughs> Derek! Where are, where are we? Lost. Look, now we're at the Route 47. Hello! Hello, how are you? Alright, thank you. You alright? Yeah, yeah. No, no, because I've been too busy. <laughs> Hello! Oh, you're going to have the steak, are you? <laughs> are you having steak? <laughs> yeah, so am I. Here we are. Here's the uh, Route 47. I've got here early, again. Here's all the cars. So far, mine's the uh, Mustang. Then we've got uh, Derek's. What's it called, Derek? Oh, he's over there. So we've got El Derek's. The Dave. Mine. What's your car called? Yeah, what's it? Is it Chevy? Herbert. Oh, he's, oh, that's Derek's Herbert. Yeah, look at this one, eh? That 20 foot long that is, that pink caddy. Looks like there's going to be a few cars here today. At least we've got a nice day for it, the sun's out. He only paid about 1500 for this, I think. Derek, what did you pay for this? How much did you pay for this? 1500 Yeah, he paid 1500 Look, oh, it's a lovely, lovely motor. You done anything to it yet? Can change. Oh yeah. Uh, cleaned it. Yeah. Bit. I like it. You could sleep in that, couldn't you? Oh yeah. I think you could have like a double bed in there. <laughs> cleaned it. Yeah, filthy. It looks in the sun. Oh no, well that's like. <laughs> any, I mean, I'm not clean mine, but it doesn't seem to show on silver, does it? No, silver's the best colour. How many coming today? I don't know. Stuart's not here. No, he's always late, isn't he? Want to use it as a rear view mirror, of course. You don't can't have a white light on the back of your car. Right. It's a moment of fame. Yeah, 15 minutes so of you fame. Can sort of put yeah. Look at that. Is this the one? Yes. Yeah. This is your baby, is it? Oh yeah. What did you put in the back? It's nothing. Here, you know what you could do in the winter summertime? Put a little. Yeah. Put some polythene, a bit of nice fluffy, not fluffy water. Yeah, God, can you imagine that, driving around? Little jacuzzi. You can do the same with this one as well. Big, isn't it? God, you can sleep in that in the summer. There's no one, look, over there, he's got the cover on his. I can hear a, a Corvette. Corvette? I can oh, hear. Not, not I can hear a Corvette. Yeah. Or has he gone past? <laughs> he's probably gone past. Is it not? I just saw him go past. He, he, he should be in that area. Yeah. No, there's one. That's uh, Stuart. Uh, Gwyn. Oh no, Gwyn. Yeah, I saw the. I saw the Corvette go. The white one. Uh, Mark. Yeah. Oh well. Who's who's left? Just Stuart. Yeah. Yeah. He can go there. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Lovely on? day for it. Yeah. When do you get your stripes? Second of April. All oh, right. It could have been the first, but we won't risk it. Yeah. <laughs> Orange, yeah? Yeah, three toned red, orange, and yellow kind of thing. Oh, nice. Should we wait for him? Have we got to wait? 
these all in. We fit them in just nice there. Right, let's go and see what this is like inside here. Route 47. Oh! Please close the door behind you. Plus, look, you get a free spider. Right, here we go. What was that here? All oh, right, yeah, yeah. It's all right, mate. Quiet. Oh, yeah. Nice. Muhammad Ali. Tyson's. I wonder if they're really Tyson's. Oh, he's got a small waist, doesn't he? Don't think I could fit my legs in there. Oh look, CP3 hour is it? Hello mate, hey you alright? Well then, what do you recommend? Do you recommend the uh, breakfast? That's sad, not do you? What do you reckon? Do you have, have a breakfast yet? Or, or a steak? Do you have a steak? No. Oh, look at that. You know, boxing stuff, isn't it? Cool, I bet he was travelling at a speed. Going through the wall like that. That's not real brickwork. Looks good though, doesn't it? That's uh, artificial, it's just uh, wallpaper. That's good, that. I like that. <laughs> Oh well, there's the Motley crew. Right, would you like to introduce yourself? This, you are. Uh, hello, you, you, Derek. Derek. My wife says I'm hopeless, but actually my name's Bill. Hello, Bill. My name is Nan. Hello, Nan. Hiya, my name's Gwyn. Hi, uh, Gwyn. Barry. Barry. Lynn. Lynn. Sandy. <laughs> and special. Special. <laughs> There's always one, isn't there? Yeah, look. I bet he was going fast, wasn't he? I bet you. <laughs> it must have been mating season, hasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> There's a music memorabilia up here. All the old uh, discs. Uh -huh. Look, see them there, you youngsters won't know what they are, they're 45s, records. Right then, let's have a look at the menu. Breakfast, pancakes, blueberry pancakes. Banana and chocolate chip pancakes, loaded pancakes, waffles, loaded waffles, chicken fried waffles, early bird steak. Hello, ten ounce sirloin steak with a, two eggs and two hash browns. Hmm, the old American. Uh, Sweet bacon, two sausages, or over the pond, three range eggs cooked. Um, right. And loaded over the pond. Loaded over the pond. I can't see that. Two, three range eggs cooked, how you like them. With thick cut bacon, rations, three sausages, ash browns, fresh tomatoes, mushrooms, and baked beans. I'll have two of them. <laughs> that, 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 that's the mega, mega one. Yeah, take a bit home as well. There's more over here as well. There's more here folks, New Yorker. 
Loaded New Yorker. Bacon and sausage bagel. Breakfast. So right, I'm going to have to have a proper look at this and see what I want. Uh, good, uh, good evening. Yeah, no. Good evening. You got your Mustang running then? Yeah, I've still got me yeah. slave wheel on. Slave yeah. Table. It didn't come till yesterday. No. Yeah. This was right. So, well, it's about six o'clock I got it. Alright. So it's too late to put the wheel on. No problem. Right. Food's all gone, by the way. We've eaten. Are you eating? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we never thought we were going to get it. Oh, Adam would love it. Well, here we have uh, a newcomer, and your name is Pete. Hello, Pete. First trip out of the bank this year. Yeah, you're not Pete and Dad, are you? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's your good wife. Caroline. Can you introduce yourself, please? Hi, Caroline. Hello, Caroline. Caroline. See, I've, I've done everyone else, but you was, you was a bit late. <laughs> Well, everybody, I've gone for the uh, early bird steak, and when it come up, I said, where's the steak? <laughs> but, as you can see, it's under my eggs, and that's a 10 ounce sirloin. But, uh, oh, hang on, look, what have you got over there then? Is it ice cream? Oh, I yeah. Ice cream for breakfast. <laughs> what you got? <laughs> Over the pond. Yeah. Over the pond. Right. Oh, well, here we go. I'm going to tuck it in there. Ah. Yeah. Now, if they would moved the eggs over there, it looks more on the plate. And I hope that's a real bit of steak and not ostrich. <laughs> you got a New Yorker. Yeah. That oh, looks alright. With scrambled egg, is it? And, yeah. and bagels and bacon. Yeah. Yeah. What's that then? That's a pancake. Gluten free. That's why it's not too. That's, oh. yeah. uh, that's more like a dessert, though, isn't it? Most yeah. Yankees, isn't it? Yeah. Anyway, what's it like, nice? Very good. Oh, good. Sorry, you recommend? Me. Sorry. Um, you, you recommend this can place? Ice cream. You ask for ice cream in the place. Yeah, no problem. Well, um, which flavour was it? Just vanilla? I'll try yeah, again. Please. That's yeah, Thank you. Would you recommend this place? Yeah, I'll try it again. I'll try it again. I don't know yet. Try I'll let you know. Oh, well, right. <laughs> well, I must admit, that sirloin steak <laughs> is very nice. Just right. Yep, I can't fault that steak at all. Except uh, I wanted it a 20 ounce. <laughs> I have. I did you come in with the loud exhaust or the quiet? Oh, I came in with a quiet one. <laughs> no, I came in with a quiet one. Well, that was very nice. I'm full up. Go outside. You've got to take a picture. I'm full up now. I've got to go outside. Here we are. We're all outside now. Sun's out. We're all up by the cars. Then we've got the older, uh, the pink, pink caddy. Then we've got my little one there. Then we've got this one here. Then we've got this one here. Then we've got this one here. Then we've got that shady character there. Then we've got this one here. And we've got this one in the end. How about that? Uh, hello everybody! Right, everybody get out! Hello! Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who's is that? Jed's. Bloody hell. Jed's the one who's always quiet. When are you going to rev it up? <laughs> <laughs>
They've only got a two litre engine in that yeah. as well. 1.3. It's <laughs> <laughs> actually a Ford Duratec. What engine is that in there? Only a 350 5.7 Chevy. Yeah. Action! Today at Oxborough Estate. Well, here I am at Oxborough Hall, Gardens and Estate, National Trust. It's a nice wall, it looks like a castle wall. It looks like it could be a mock castle, this building. Let's go through the arched doorway. Hiya. Hello. Right, I'm gonna go and have a cup of coffee, I think. Right, where's the tea room? Oh, 
Hot drinks. Cold drinks. Cakes and bakes. Tea room. Brunch. Light meals. Sandwiches. We've got a lot of stuff here. Jacket potatoes. That lot. Not bad for a national trust. And one mixed chili. Oh well, I might as well sit outside in the courtyard. Just bought myself a cappuccino, half a cup, and uh, after I've had this, I'll go and look around the house. Well, the oldest part of this building was built in 1482, before the Tudor times. Just before the Tudor times, yes. I'm very knowledgeable. I'm very knowledgeable, aren't I? <laughs> Do you mind being on film? <laughs> me? Yeah. You want to be on the film for? <laughs> no, you don't mind, do you? Don't mind. Do you want to give me a little bit of history? Well, as I said, more or less begins in 4082. Yep. The Beddingfeld family that still lived down in that yep. turret, down at the end of the corridor, yep. inherited um, the whole estate, about right. 3,000 acres at the time. 3,000 acres? Yes. God. Very large at the time. That is. Farmland. Do you know what that is in hectares? I can't remember. <laughs> because if I chop I'll, and change, I get them wrong. I'm being okay? facetious. Okay, well, you can look that up, 3,000 acres. And... Um, Okay, and it was about perhaps 12 or yeah. more manor houses, farmhouses really? on it. And the first Beddingfeld wanted to decorate this one up because yeah. he wanted it as his prestigious home. Yeah. So he chose brick. Yeah. It was expensive in those days. Yeah. It was prestigious. It still is now. It yeah. is not a defensive material. You would not, no. although they've got crenellations yeah. and, you know, yeah, it looks as though it might be a fighting house. Yeah. Not really. No. Um, because you don't put brick and you don't put no. beautiful glass over your front door. Well, I, I used to be a brick lad. I worked on Alexandra Palace. And the oh. brickwork there was four foot thick. And uh, we was up on one of the towers and the, the foreman was Italian. And we said, well, shall we bond this? So we should bond it inside. He said, no. yeah. he said, don't worry. He said, they, the clerk of words won't come up. They only came up and checked it. We had everything in there, you name it. So we had to do it properly. Oh, and the bullseyes, you know, the, the, yes, they yeah. were six foot. They were to build up, yeah. But I know all about brickwork and... Uh, as I say, the Tudor, that's where you get your Tudor bond from. Okay, right. And then you've got flying, flying Flemish. Right. Uh, oh, I can't remember that. It's a long time ago. Well, listen, you're going to revive all your interests. Yeah. You know more <laughs> about brickwork than I do. Um, okay, it was brickwork and more important perhaps for you the yeah. medieval foundations brickwork yeah. never gave us a day's problem. No. The Tudor part didn't give any particular problems, no. but... What had to be repaired recently, and it yeah. was a six point four million pound project, oh, right. yeah, yeah. was actually what went up and what was refurbished in the eighteen right. hundreds. Um, yeah, because the foot footings would just be bricks corbelled out. Yes. Yeah, they go down and down. Below. But apparently, bricks have a stability point in terms of moisture. I do, I suppose and once they, do, they reach yeah. that level, That's, they yeah. may not dry out. That's true. They always, you know, yeah. the moat may not dry. But out. I reckon cement never dries out. Yeah, but I don't know what kind of cement they used yeah. in the 50s. Well, the Romans, I mean, their stuff now, when you think about it. Yeah. Uh, what room are we in now? Saloon. Oh, we're in the saloon? Yeah. Is that, where's the beer? Yeah. <laughs> and the horse and the cowboy. Yeah. <laughs>
first or so and decided it was going to be terrible. Later on in the works they found the actual uh, 1550 inch that's from. Uh, it was called the King's Psalms and the Queen's Prayers. There's only three of those in the world. So there's two before, now there's three. Yeah. So the other two people are not very happy about it, obviously. No, no, about it. No. <laughs> yeah. But if you look at if you look in the base of the of the stand there you can see what the cover looks like. Very ornate. Yeah. yeah. Um, and what I like about this story is that experts have obviously looked through it. We, you know, it's not the sort of thing you just open. What experts have looked at it, and there's a reference in there to the Great Plague, in London. Is it? Yeah. Right. Um, and that was discovered during our Great Plague. And how old is that? Well, yeah. Fifteen fifty. Yeah. Discovered during COVID. Oh. So there's a there's an irony there. Yeah, yeah. 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 What was that about the rats? I heard. That that's how they first discovered it when they was doing the roof. They discovered a rat's nest and picked oh, it apart, yeah. and it was just that tiny scrap of paper. So they knew oh, there was a prayer book. There. <laughs> and then later on in the works, they, yeah. they found out. Unbelievable. But the house is 500 years old. I'm sure well, yeah. there's, more, there's more secrets. Oh, yeah. Is to, there to, any to ghost, is there? There is a ghost, apparently. Is there? Back in a drawing room. Oh, I like, thought I just saw the, 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 some lady around. sitting there. No. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah apparently, apparently I've got the ghost, but I've not seen it. But, uh, um, but in a house 500 years old, there's so many stories. Of course, there is. Yeah, and, um, I've got a ghost in my car. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, mate. Yeah, cheers. This is then Charles the Second Burlington. Oh, lucky shoes. I don't know. Have you got yours? Go back down to see that's gonna be no to photo the staircase. Yeah. What's this? Leather leather wool gatherings. Oh yeah. Oh that's leather. Look at all that. On the walls. It's all leather. Clever. Ah, oh, that floor's over 500 years old, that floor. It still looks good. But Protestantism was the main reason we found a Catholic priest, or his days were numbered. Because it would have started, the day would have started early, you know, in the May, we've been now doing the fires and things. Mm -hmm. Big knock, mm -hmm. and the door at the main gate is right below us here. Yeah. Okay. So. Oh, this is one of the towers. No entry. I can walk up there anyway on my knees. Look, look how thick the walls are. That two foot, I reckon. Look at the craftsmanship. Look, this brickwork. Look at the way it curves. And then comes down now. Oh. You don't see that nowadays. Even those bricks actually are shaped. Fantastic. Absolutely. And even the handrail is all stone. And these are already made specially and recessed in there, all the way down. Must have taken ages to build. Oh God, my knees. Uh, 
Look at that for a door, eh? That's solid oak. That door. 500 years old. And so are these doors as well. Look at the thickness of these. Solid oak. All those years are still there. After 500 years. Look at that little knocker. See the vaulted ceiling? Even that's all night inside there. Come inside the gum room and find out about our transformational roof project. Well, okay, another one of them oak doors. Another place there. I always think when I go around these old buildings, people that were there when they were living here. I wonder if they would have thought there'd be people coming around looking at their place that they lived in and uh, end up with little plastic hats on the table and Lego for the kids. There again, what about another? 500 years, if it's still here, what would be like then? Right, see the moulds here? They're still hard after all those years, look. If you can try and look up there, try and see how... still vertical, if you can see. It's still vertical after all those years. Competition question this week is how many bricks are there in Oxburgh Hall? Answers on a postcard, please. There's always a second hand bookshop at these places. I think I'll go and have a look. Well, goodbye, Oxburgh Hall. Where's my car? There it is. Alright, let's get back home.